up guys welcome back to the channel i'm louis b and today we're going to be reviewing the godzilla 2000 millennium special color version from the sh montrose line so this is just a version from the godzilla with the godzilla 2000 with the purple spikes the original but it was a repaint they made a repaint which was gladly amazing because that's how i got this figure because i saw the repaint i was like wow how that's really cool so we're going to be reviewing the box first and then we're going to start doing the review now we get a uh you know cool pose of godzilla right here with the uh the color box is purple and it's pretty cool yeah i like it and so um yeah the you can see the claws right here i mean i can't stop looking at that <laughs> it's pretty cool though you got the little warning signs and then under the box you've got the sh monster arts logo right here a bunch of warnings a bunch of chinese logos i don't know and when we go right here we have we have the you know logo a little part of godzilla's hand right here and then when we go up to see we get the full main attraction on a picture see this is Godzilla. This is an exclusive, by the way. It's pretty cool. It's Godzilla. We know the figure. This is another pose of Godzilla. This is another pose, a back pose of Godzilla. This is Godzilla's full face. This is just, you know, Godzilla doing a little pose with his tail up. I mean, it's so cool, guys. I've tried to repackage this so we can make the review. Here you got another cool pose of Godzilla. Bigger pose. Amazing. Another few claws. This is, uh, you know, a, the top of the box. Uh, the SH Martial Arts logo, the little scratches, you know, Godzilla 2000 Millennium special color version, you know, nothing really like big up here. So. And right here we have the full, the full like um, box. This is basically the entire box, and um, I guess we should start unboxing the box because it's a box. <laughs> I guess it's let's do this. So, we'll start by opening it from up here, because I usually open it from the tape. And you just start scratching the tape, or maybe scratch scratching the top. That's what I always do. Just scratch the top. Take it off, and boom! You got yourself an opening box. I love this box, by the way, guys. It's a pretty cool box. And there you guys got the main attraction. Now, we got some... Um, I can see some paper protecting it. I don't know if you guys can catch that. Um, not paper, like little wraps, wrap ups, so it protects the plastic and such. So, just gonna put this up. We don't need this, right? Um, and then we have a little. Oh, that was um, that was a shame. Wow. So I don't know if you guys saw that, but the tail just fell off like it was ready to come off okay okay wow all right all right so guys here we have the sh monstroids 2019 godzilla now let me get this camera in a perfect position where i can review this figure finally so guys i have the craziest story of this guy so Two days ago, I ordered a Godzilla 2000 Millennium Special Color Version SH from SH Monster Arts, and I ordered it from Amazon. However, this guy was like just so cool to me, you know. Like it was one, like it was like okay, I'll get that one then. And yeah, I loved it. And that, you guys will see that after this SH Monster Arts, we're gonna get the Mecha Godzilla SH Monster Arts Kiryu. So you guys should be excited for that one. But look at all the detail on this, man. Wow. So I was just up in my room after two days of ordering this thing. I was just watching my, you know, daily dose of, not daily dose, but, you know, I guess two, you can say two-day dose of Godzilla. Uh, you know, Godzilla collections and Godzilla figures, you know, people reviewing these things. And I was like, I wonder where mine is. And then my mom just calls me over, hey. Yeah, and then she just surprises me with the package. I was like, wait. And then she's like, oh, you got a package. And I was like, wow, okay. And then I opened it, and I guess, of course, I was just not even that much of a surprise. 
that I get the SH Monster Rides Godzilla 2000, which was a pretty big awesome thing because this guy is full of articulation, but he has some looseness, which if you move the tail, this thing pops off every time, which is a little bit of a complaint, but it's not bad. I really like this guy. He'll fit in my collection and he'll fit in the stop motion. So um, I guess let's get on to the detail, viewing the detail and um, let's get on to the review, guys. So first of all, if I can close this figure up, we're going to get from toe to head. So no, I'm going to start right here with the tail then we'll get to the you know feet. So the tail here, uh, you can see, let me just grab this. Um, the tail right here, it starts up to here. You know, the start spike starts, then we get up to the bigger spikes, and then they just get bigger and bigger as always. And they're huge up here. And as you can see, that it's a repaint. And wow, it's amazing. And then we get to the head. And I mean, look at all these details, the, like the roughed up skin and everything. It's all always going to be rough. I mean, I really like the, you know, rough skin. It was pretty cool. But look at that. Look at those spikes. I mean, wow. That's a good reap. It's, it's good paint. Let's see under here. Wow, they even painted the bottom. I mean, kind of, not right here, kind of, but, you know, they kind of painted it right. Wow, and then the detail, you can see some green right here, right here. You can see some green, dirty green. And then, wow, and then the bottom, you get, you always get that little, you know, white logo thing. And then, oh my god. And the spikes, phenomenal, amazing. If we get to the head, the teeth are just so cool but you know this part if you guys can catch it right here it's bleeding it was bleeding i guess and i feel like a lot of people have those complaints so yeah but his teeth are a little bit red because the paint from the gums the eyes man if you guys can catch that the eyes are really cool they're not like bad i really like them and the head sculpt is just amazing you can see the ears right here Wow, whoever makes these. I mean, I know the SH Monsterized line makes these, but wow, they wow people. Whoa, this, this was pretty cool, guys. So I guess let's get it with the articulation. So for the articulation, if we can um, go from the tail to, you know, up and, you know, such. So it has 24, you know, segments. And they can move. You can move like this far oops um this thing just popped off but yeah it could probably move like this far maybe farther if it didn't break off but when i do this it goes that way it always goes back that way like and then if i try to put it up it goes down <laughs> it's just a little ridiculous but it's funny and like i really like it uh i really love this figure i paid like 175 dollars for it it was really nice so it's pretty cool it's i guess i'm gonna say it's worth it a little stiff on the foot um yeah and when you move it it's just a little stiff i mean it's probably not a little stiff it's probably a little too stiff but yeah and it can just move a little here let's see and then swivel kind of right here not really right here yeah it moves up and down and swivels all the way 360 but I don't know why you would want to swivel 360, I'm just saying. But it's, this is a review, so we have to get everything. Same here on the foot. It's pretty... It's the same as this one. Same as stiff, too. When we get to the... Uh, right here. Can move it. Not all the way, because of the spikes. But, yeah. And then the head, you can move it all the way down, guys. All the way down super down guys and then you can just move it up this is as far as i'm gonna say this is as far as you can move it because i'm afraid if i move it more it's gonna snap or something something's gonna snap and wow this thing is amazing and then you know get that whoa and the tail i mean i like the tail guys but it's a little like loose and i kind of like loose joints because it just bothers me whenever i'm trying to just like mess around with this figure it's pretty cool though and um you open the mouth and you get the tongue you you get you can always open the mouth but it's always gonna stay like this because um you know in the movie they're dragging out and such and such and then um yeah i mean it's pretty it's a pretty good figure and the arms 
they I forgot the arms they they spread a little this wide this wide and then they can rotate all the way 360 I'm not gonna do that a lot ever again <laughs> you can swivel this swivel the arm I mean not not the arm the hand and then um, same for this one swivel the hand you know move it 360 I don't know why I'm doing this again <laughs> um, I mean, the arms are so amazing. I love this figure, personally. I do recommend that you get this figure. And um, it's sold out at Big Bad Toy Store. I've seen it. But I recommend you guys to get this figure because it's amazing. And I, I'm going to say it's worth it. And uh, I mean, it has good articulation. It was just a little loose in the tail. That's fine. Uh, I don't really have a problem with that. Some people will. But um, yeah, I do recommend this figure. Um, it was pretty cool, though. I really liked it and you know it was amazing and this figure you know it was detailed you that's why you should get it detailed articulated a little loose by the way in the tail but it was still cool and it was a cool design i loved how they repainted it and i bet the the other version it was a little looser too so uh well, a little more looser than this one i'm gonna say but yeah guys if you guys like this review subscribe leave a comment what leaving leave a comment about what you like about this figure and would you get this figure if it were up to you or if you know you know whatever and then subscribe because that will help me out to get more godzilla figures just like this one and get more action figures to review to do stop motions with and That'll just help me out a lot more, and I will be able to afford these a lot more. So, if you guys can do me a favor and subscribe, I will appreciate it so much, and I will do more stop motions. No doubt. So, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. And I thought this was going to come in six days, but it came in two days. Wow. That was... Let's give it to Amazon, guys, and, and shipping, you know? So, I'll see you guys later. Um, And, yeah. Goodbye.